So, Shailes, looking at the demos that you have on the Qualcomm stand here at Mobile World Congress in Barcelona, there's this theme around combining advanced cloud with advanced connectivity, but maybe take us through it a little bit. Sure. So we have uh, two demos here today, and both are sort of showing the synergy between our Snapdragon auto connectivity platform and our car to cloud platform. Uh, the first demo is about uh, VRU or pedestrian bicyclist safety, where we are showing how connectivity with cloud can help with safety of pedestrians and uh, uh, cyclists. And the other is about uh, convenience, where we show that how connectivity with cloud can be combined to predict coverage, which can help a, a user in the car, like a driver or passenger and have better services, basically. Okay, so tell us a little bit more about the vulnerable road user piece. Uh, what exactly are you doing, and how, how do you understand where people are, where they might be, and how does that all map into this larger theme around driving safety? Sure. So, uh, in US, what we see is that the number of uh, pedestrian deaths are close to a 40-year high, basically, and they're increasing. So this is something that we are effort to sort of improve that. And what we are doing is that we have uh, vulnerable road users like pedestrians or bicyclists, uh, their mobile phones are reporting their location uh, uh, once per second to the cloud, to our car to cloud service. And our car to cloud service um, sort of filters that information and gives that information to the vehicle. And the vehicle can then decide how to show that information to the driver. So the main benefit of this approach is that you know you can deploy this service now, you don't need any advanced technology. And the driver can be aware of uh, any pedestrian or bicyclist that is coming in the future, even though he cannot see them on the windshield. So you can see them much before they actually show up in his vision, basically. And this cannot be done by any of the camera, radar, or LiDAR sensors, basically. And then this other demo, this is just really interesting to me, so I, I'm looking forward to you expanding on it. But the idea of using telemetry from a vehicle to predict coverage. Just uh, take us through that. Yeah, so that's an interesting one. So um, this is sort of uh, driven by the fact that, you know, uh, cars are getting more connected and we want uninterrupted service basically, right? And um, as you drive along, you could collect data on coverage um, and it could be your own vehicle driving along um, or it could be some other, uh, somebody else's vehicle that is driving along and collecting that data and then that can be processed in the cloud and you can use that data to uh, figure out that as I'm driving whether there are areas of bad coverage. And if I know that, then I can, uh, for example, buffer my streaming videos that are happening earlier automatically. I can download maps earlier or I can do a handover earlier. So there are multiple things that you can do with this basically. But the key thing is that we are automating how a vehicle learns uh, the coverage without uh, involving any operator, and the automaker can just use it to learn coverage, basically. Yeah, well, Qualcomm really has a, a big, bold automotive strategy and a really deep portfolio, so it, a lot more than infotainment, though, as you've yes. shown me today, this uh, emphasis on VRU and then this angle around predicting coverage is fascinating stuff. Thank you so much for sharing it with our audience. Sure, thank you.